also have it's kind of a dual dual thing you're a positive guy and you're easy to interact with but you have a certain natural ability to to, to exude a certain amount like leadership right leadership skills so it's kind of like yeah this is a nice guy but you also know that this guy's got his stuff to get you know what i mean and so it's uh it's it's a combination of that i guess you would say uh, right well then, um, so Nick, why don't you uh, why don't you keep going and uh, take us through Rosa? <laughs> oh my God, I've been talking about Rosa all day. Um, <laughs> no, it's really just just very impressive. Obviously, she's very good looking. Um, <laughs> we're, we're we're good to go with that. We're all well. Apparently, we're all very secure in our looks, um, <laughs> so, and that's important because you really don't want to be stuck on a spaceship <laughs> with a bunch of. Yeah, a bunch of bows or bowels. <laughs> exactly. You know, you got to have that that appeal. Uh, uh, where, okay, competent is kind of like an understatement to to a large degree, but they're just it's it's hard to find good creative words sometimes. But Rosa takes and what we were looking at there um, is uh, the ability to interact with many different people. And kind of bring it all together so that we all understand what's going on. And that was kind of what we were looking at as far as the envision portion of it. Um, I don't know if you realize it or believe me or not, Rosa, but you do this with a relative ease. That is absolutely impressive to me. Honestly, of all the people, I would not want your job. Okay. I, I don't think I could do it very well. You're, you're awesome at it. You're beyond competent in everything that you do, which again, when you think about it, it touches all of us, right? So we're flying along and Jim and I are going through our stuff and then you put it together and say, okay, this is what we need to do. And this is how we need to do it. Okay. And so, you know, you're, you're, you're kind of like the heartbeat of it. You know what I mean? You're, you're the focus without you. The rest of us are sort of, we're stuck in our own little worlds. You bring us all together. And that's where we put the, what, you know, why they should go is that, you know, Jim and I will be doing our thing and trying to work it out, but, Rosa is going to be able to get us to be able to communicate with the Martians so that once we get there, uh, we don't get ourselves in trouble or, or you know, <laughs> we know where to go or she would learn Martian on the way to Mars, right? <laughs> Jim and yeah. I would be kicking back having a cigar going, Hey, we're going to do this. Rosa would be figuring out how the hell to talk to the people. So yeah, that's great. You know, so that's, that's, great. that's, that's kind of the way I see that. Um, as far as myself's concerned, really, I just, uh, like I said, I, I kind of was explaining that, you know, my, my teams, once I get, once we get that connection and once we develop that. Hey, Nick, you're not talking about yourself there, are you? Yeah, well, Jimmy's, yeah, Jimmy's, Jimmy's that's, that's, that's supposed to be me. To oh, I'm sorry. That. I don't know. I'm off topic. Don't shoot me. <laughs> Jim needs to step in here. Hey. Well, you know, let's go, Mission Lead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, first of all, it, um, one of the reasons that we picked ourselves is we, we didn't really say this, but I think we're all very good at what we do and highly competent. And there's no, there's no stupid people in amongst the three of us. And as Gallagher once said, you know, if you're ugly, go get plastic surgery. <laughs> if you're stupid, that's forever. <laughs> and can't we couldn't stupid. afford stupid people fix- on the long trip to Mars. Yeah, so, can't fix stupid. <laughs> can't fix stupid. Uh, I, love I have that. all kinds of stupid <laughs> quotes. I got a million of them. Uh, mm-hmm. yeah, uh, I'll bet you do. You're, you're fine. So it's what John Wayne once said. You know, life is hard. It's harder if you're stupid. Exactly. <laughs> I love that. But anyway, uh, uh, Nick, you can tell just from talking to Nick, he is an absolute pillar of integrity. It you can. Hear it in is the inflection of his voice. You can uh, see it in in uh, his his uh, nonverbal expressions. Uh, you're looking at Mr. Integrity, and honesty goes along with that. Uh, obviously, incredibly ruggedly handsome in a Robert Redford sort of way. <laughs> and yeah. I'm buying you lunch, Jim. Yeah, uh, motivated to get the job done. You it. When when a when a gentleman is sitting here saying, you know, if I'm getting a phone call and and I gotta I can't talk to you right now, but I'm gonna pick up my phone and text back, uh, you know that he's motivated to ensure that his client's taken care of and he cares about other people and 
making sure that they're being uh, serviced as a client properly. Mm-hmm. And of course, being in the safety arena, you know, he's safety focused and uh, we would need safety on that long journey to Mars. Mm-hmm. And obviously uh, uh, a great defender against uh, any aliens that we would come across. So when you look at, <laughs> at Nick, uh, and Rosa and myself, I think what we do, to take a quote from Jerry Maguire, is that we sort of complete each other. Aww. And it's a, and this was Rosa's idea, by the way, which I think demonstrates her ability to communicate. And on the first exercise we did, Nick and I came up with most of the words, but Rosa's the one that got them in the right order and then it contributed to that. So we all mm-hmm. have contributed and have uh, been a part of what we've done today. And a lot of times you don't have that in these kinds of exercises. And that's pretty yeah. refreshing. Actually, so. Yeah. yeah. That, that's all I have to say. So I'm good. We yeah, would yeah. bring out the best in each other. You know, mm-hmm. like, you we'd bring out our strengths. Yeah. Yeah. And that's why we like to try to make sure the breakout rooms have a good, you know, mix of people from different different backgrounds and everything. And it, it really has been a, just a super dynamic team you guys make. Yeah. Yeah, really good. I want to go to Mars with you guys. <laughs> More than welcome. This you're is good, awesome. You're good looking. You fit the bill. <laughs> got it covered. You're good looking too. <laughs> number one, it's the number one requirement. You notice well, what that women the number one is good looking, but I'm down at number like three. <laughs> and we, you know, this, crew, this crew doesn't do ugly. So. Yeah. You know what? Doesn't do ugly, doesn't do stupid. That, yeah. that, should, that should be our tagline. We don't do ugly. That's <laughs> <laughs> different from when I was in college and I was out, you know, chasing girls. We had a, a, a comment. It was called GUE, go ugly early. That way you, <laughs> that way you knew you, could, you would always have somebody to dance with. <laughs> <laughs> well, Gosh, I I, uh, I don't know if the girls do that. They thought they were scoring all that, you know, thinking, ooh, I've got my dance card filled up. <laughs> they could have been thinking the same thing about me, and I wouldn't have known it. So, no. Well, one thing that absolutely comes out to me here is that, you know, you you the company has has absolute integrity. They're very serious and competent about what they do, but they have fun. Yeah. You know, there's, there's just this level of fun and humor, um, somewhere in the company that, that is important on some level and mm-hmm. maybe just to some joy or, you know, or just happiness. You guys, you know, you don't mind getting up and coming to work for sure. It sounds yeah. like you like what you do. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, otherwise, why, why, why uh, yeah. Or, and, and why, you know, if you, if you don't really like what you do, you don't, you wouldn't bother to engage like this and, and, uh, right have fun with it like this. Right. Any right. other patterns coming out that you see Gail or, or any of the team? No, no, I, I just think this is very interesting how it, it just is a, a punctuation point to all the lead up discussions, right. And talking about synergy mm-hmm. and, you know, um, synergy. Yeah. That's so the other I mean, thing. It just, it just really came out here. As you said, you know, you brought up, through this, you brought out the best in each other, use your strengths to come up with something really, um, really crystal. Yeah. 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 And, and you took the, um, opportunity with this. I like how you, um, each astronaut brought, you know, you didn't obviously duplicate roles here. You know, you had three spaces on the ship.